Hey guys, Ryan from Scotland here, and here we are for the third part in my ROM hacking tutorial series. Cam Studio is being an absolute pain in the butt just now, so I'm going to record this. This is like the tenth time I tried it. I'm going to record this, and if it doesn't get the video and the sound, I'm just going to keep this sound and then redo the video because I'm so fed up going over the same stuff over and over again. So if it's not quite syncing up, that'll be why. Okay, enough of my morning. Let's get on with the tutorial. So as I said, here we are in the third part of the series. We've so far looked at numbers, namely decimal numbers, hexadecimal numbers, and binary numbers. And this time we're going to look at actually applying the stuff that we have learned. So let's get on with it. Okay, for this tutorial, you're going to need to pick up yourself a copy of the Mega Drive Emulator Gens. There's a few different flavors, doesn't matter which one you take. I'm going to use Gens KMod for the majority of this tutorial. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to uh, I'll throw it onto full screen so you can see what I'm doing. And I'm going to open up the ROM Lemmings. So you'll need to get yourself a copy of the Lemmings ROM. Something that you'll need to keep in mind is that I normally use European or the PAL versions of the ROMs. So if you don't have that version, it might be the offsets that I use do not work for you. Now it's going to be a bit of a pain, but eventually I'll teach you how to find your own offsets so it won't be a problem. But in the meantime, if you can grab the European or the PAL versions, you'll find most of this stuff works for you. I will at some point get round to putting up on my site which version you should be using. But for now, I'm afraid you're going to just have to survive with what I've got. Okay, so let's get this game started. If you've been watching my videos, you'll see the last video I did was actually of a game of lemmings, and we played this level as well. We played Just Dig, which has 10 lemmings to start with. You need to save 10%, and they're released at about 50. Release rate 50. I've never, I'm not sure what that means. 50, 50 per minute, or goodness knows. Anyway, we'll fire it right up to 99 to get them all out. Lemmings, lemmings, lem, 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 lem. No, enough of that. We're not here for playing. We're here for tutorials, so, you know, no singing. So as you can see, I've got 10 lemmings out. I can't do anything with them except dig. I can just dig, as the level is called. And that, you know, that's pretty much our level. That's, you know, it's the first level. It's not meant to be that amazing. It's just to get you ready, get used to controls and that. But... I know how to play lemmings, you know how to play lemmings, so let's make it a bit more fun. What I'm doing now is I'm just restarting the game, I hit hard reset there, I'm going to get back to the point where the level's just about to start, I'm going to create a save state. So that's file, save state as. I'm going to throw it in my ROMs lemmings directory, and I'm going to call it lemmings as well. And be sure not to overwrite your bin file there, just call it lemmings, or you can call it lemmings.gs0 if you want, which is the actual extension that Gens uses. Don't worry if you don't want to put that, it'll work anyway. So we're going to save that, and we're going to pause our game. No, we're not. We're going to close our game, because I do not want that lemmings tune playing over and over whilst I'm not playing the game. The temptation to sing will just be too great. So now let's jump into our ROMs and our lemmings directory, and there we can see the save state that we created. Now what we're going to do is we're going to open that up into our hex editor. I'm still using HXD, which means I can just drag and drop it straight in. And you can see here all the information that is stored in that file. Now, if you've looked over my last tutorials, or if you already know this stuff, you'll know that each of these numbers is in a hexadecimal representation, and that's why we can see things like FC... Um, EA, where else? Uh, yeah, AC, things like that. And we know that this is, you know, just numbers. It's just numbers. Nothing to worry about. It's just numbers. Okay. So now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to open up my website, mybrogamesite.com, which I'm sure you're all very familiar with. As you can see, it's got a really good new look since, um, since well, let's see, when's it since updated site to new layout? since 27, I'm not sure when that is, it was a couple of months back, and there's been some more information since then. No two recent updates, but this one will be up there soon. And I'm going to jump into the hacking section, and then into the Mega Drive section, and you can see a few games here, and we're looking at Lemmings just now. Okay, 
So you can see I've got no information for the ROM for lemmings, but I do have information for the save state. And what we have is the offsets, so that's the um, the spot that the data is stored at that we are going to change. The length of the data, so each of these is just one byte, which means, you know, 00, zero or FF. Useful values, which are 00, zero through to FF, which means, you know, these are the values that are worth putting in. Anything that is over here or isn't in here is probably going to make the game crash straight away, so it's not really worth having. And here is the effect of what entering that information does. So what we're interested in just now is changing the amount of lemons that are dispensed. This is what I've done in my last video. So if we look back, that is offset 11955. Let's just copy that, highlight control C, jump into the hex editor, and it's control G, which brings up the go to menu, paste our information with control V, lots of keyboard shortcuts here. This is what the professionals do. And we'll hit OK. And you can see it's highlighted here. I'll just pull up to the middle of the screen. The value OA, which is exactly the amount of lemons that start in this level. Of course, if you've done your hex, you know that this is 10. OA is 10 in hex, decimal 10. So we're going to change that. We're going to max it out to FF because we want a lot of lemmings to play with. Control S to save that. And a little keyboard shortcut there for you. And we'll close it and minimize. HXD will minimize the website. Let's just done with that for just now. Minimize our fur, bring back gens, and we'll reload our ROM by jumping into the ROM history and reloading the last file. Now we don't need to watch the intro on that again. We could jump straight into file load state, back into our lemmings folder, which is ROMs lemmings, lemmings GSO, and open. And this time, if things have went right, we should find that we have more lemons to play with. Brilliant. And you can see the lemons just keep streaming out, streaming out, streaming out. Okay. Now, if you've been doing your homework and you've went over my last tutorials, you should know that FF is equal to 255, 255 in decimal. So I'm just going to let this sit and we can get as much lemmings as possible out into the game. I'll take this moment to tell you about a website which has huge amounts of information. It's just got a database full of offsets that you can play with in ROM hacking. I think there's some state, save states in there as well. And it's just brilliant. There's so much information there which can make things a lot easier for you. My later tutorials will go into how to find this information. But for now, just grabbing it off the site makes life so much easier. This website, I cannot for the life of me remember the name of it. So I'm going to check it out because I've got it saved in my favourites and then I will post it up in the description and you can get it from there. Definitely check it out, tell them Ryan Fiscal and sent you and just, you know, have fun. Okay, we've got some problems here where the graphics are just glitching like, what is this guy doing? He's trying to escape. Oh, okay, I think we'll just get rid of all these guys. Time to die. Um. You can see, obviously, the Mega Drive processor is just not powerful enough to contain or to control this amount of sprites. So it's just sort of flipping out and breaking. Um, so there we go. We're lowering the numbers now. We're we're saving things. Might mean I feel the level though, but hey, never mind. At least at least my Mega Drive is not going to break. All right, guys, it's just an emulator, so it's all good. With the save state changes, you can't actually use these on the real hardware because it's a save state. It's not a ROM that you're changing, which means that you can't apply these changes onto the actual hardware. When we get to actual ROM editing, those are changes that you can apply through the use of the Action Replay or the Game Genie. Um, action Replays tends to be better. Game Genie, you can only put in like a limited amount in that. But I mean, we're working with emulators, which is a lot more fun for ROM hacking because doing it on the actual hardware can take forever. It's pretty cool if you can get it to work on the actual hardware, but I wouldn't worry about it too much. As you can probably tell, my game has crashed. Yeah, I think I went a bit overboard. Let's open that save back up into HXD. Um, I'll just jump straight into XXD and open up Lemmings and go to is still there, 11955. I'm going to lower this down a little bit from FF. That was obviously way too much. I'll lower it to about A0, which is roughly half, not exactly half, but roughly half of FF. Um, I think 7F or 8 zero is actually half, but you know, we're all friends here. These small things can slide. 
what I'll do whilst I'm here as well is I'm going to change the amount of different skills I have available for me because just having diggers isn't that much fun. So let's see, climbers starts at 11902 and then the rest of the offsets just follow on from there for everything else. So if I jump to 11902, it's just there. Um, oh yeah, if you look here, you can see OA, which is 11909, which 11909 is the amount of diggers available on the level, which as we would expect is 10. So let's go to 11902. Um, we'll change all these to FF. Normally, when I'm first changing a value, I like to max it out. I like to go crazy and put it straight up to the absolute maximum that I can. Then I can see if it's going to work or not. If it doesn't work, take it down to half and then go up and maybe tens or so until it breaks. And that way you can find out what the most useful values are from the maximum to the minimum. And so we're going to go with FF. We're going to load the state in again. Mega Drive, ROMs, Lemmings, Lemmings. And if things have went right, we should see the amount of Lemmings is more than 10. Fine. And we have lots of different skills to play with. Brilliant. We've got everything here. Let's get some builders out there. Build, build, build. You're free. You're free. You're free to be what you want to be, to do what you want to do. Superb. You can see the graphics are a little broken here. Don't worry about that. That's uh, not a problem. This will happen quite often when you change things in game, especially counters and that, that aren't meant to go to a certain height. Each of these, the maximum normally in game, would be 99, whereas we've set them all to 225, which just means there's a couple of pointers pointing to the wrong place for the numbers. You know, they're trying to find 10s when they can only find 9s and that and it's screwing up the graphics but it's definitely not worth worrying about um okay that's just got as much lines as we're going to get 160 so ao in hex means 160 in decimal there's a little bit more math for you we do like a good bit of math uh, let's see if we can get some of these guys out can we punch our way out oops can we punch our way this way no that way means death what does this way mean ah survival's this way okay let's mix it up a bit and we'll do this level without any diggers punch 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 actually no 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 one likes to see the lemmings actually survive do they let's blow them all up again <laughs> so there we go guys that is the next step in your rom hacking adventure going by my tutorials you learned what the numbers mean you now know how to use them using the information from my site and from the other site I will put this link in I'm so sorry that I can't remember the site it's a really good one I will get that link in the description for you and pardon me sorry oh I think someone's gonna make it oh that guy made it did that guy make it I think the guy made it um yeah I'll get that link in the description you also need to check out Hacking Cult and see if it's back up. Oh no, we didn't make it. Poor guy. He was so close. It wasn't last time I checked. Hacking Cult was still down. So everyone keep checking it out so the guy gets it back up. He'll see his uses statistics and they'll be like, Oh my god, I need to get the site back up. And hopefully they'll get it back up. Romhacking.net, it's still there. It's still awesome. So check that out. And I think that's about everything. Yeah. Alright guys, so... Thanks for checking this. Be sure to look at my site, mobilegamesite.com. Check the sites I've mentioned. Check the one in the description. And stay tuned. Hopefully I will get another video out before next year. No promises.